The time has finally come and I am so very, very excited to get started. Hey guys, how are you all doing? My name is Andrew. Welcome back to another video and a brand new series on my channel, brand new fresh for 2022. I am doing the My Player Career Mode on FIFA 22. I have been wanting to do something on FIFA for a long, long time, just never really known quite what to do. And so now I am finally glad that I have found something that I can make videos on and hopefully have good fun doing as well. So my pro will be called Nathan Jackson. He wears the shirt number 12. He is from England, born the 15th of June 2004, making him 17 years old. And I have chosen to play him as Manchester United. Okay, so it's time to advance on and see who we get in the first friendly game of the new season. So yeah, Man United versus Roma FC. Man United are 2-1 down. We are being brought on in the 81st minute to see if we can help turn the game around and get the point back for United. Okay, so we have to get a match rating of 6.5, get at least one goal or assist and have a dribble success rate of 30%. The box it goes. And oh great, so we start out with not scoring a goal, but also letting Roma score a goal instead. What a brilliant start to the career mode that was. It was a pretty good goal to be fair, we're going to see it again anyway. Header, top corner, boom. And we're at kickoff once again, here we go. Cavani back to Ronaldo to Jackson here. What can Jackson do with it to Ronaldo? And Ronaldo has a shot at goal, but the keeper manages to divert it away. Cavani again. Back to Jackson now. And Jackson loses it. And then Roma are away once again. Okay, Ronaldo to Jackson. Let's see what Jackson can do with the ball now. Back to Ronaldo. Oh, Jackson goes over the top of someone. Ronaldo now to Jackson once again. Jackson loses it, still has it. Oh, takes a shot on goal. And they header it out for a Man United corner. With a Man United corner, Ronaldo to take. Crosses it in. Header over the top. On the ball, Zaniolo. And Manchester United have it back. Fred to Cavini. To McTonney. To Jackson. What can Jackson do with it here? He loses it. Cavini gets it back. Loses it once again. Pogba's got it. McTonney's got it. Jackson. Ronaldo shoots and the cross. The shot is cleared. And it also looks like Ronaldo has gone down injured. That does not look good for us. Losing one of our key strikers at this point would not be good. Let's have another look at it here. So he takes a shot on goal. And I don't know whether he landed awkwardly or what happened. But So he's having to come off. Martel's coming on in replacement of Ronaldo. Having to come off injured. I would assume at this point anyway, that's not going to be good. But we've got a Man United corner. Oh, cross in, headed towards goal. Keeper managed to save. Yeah, so Ronaldo has gone off injured here. That's not good. That may not bode well for the rest of our friendlies. We'll have to wait and see. We have another corner here. Pogba to cross in. Oh, there's some scurrying around in the middle, and they win it back from us, and Man United back on it once again. Oh, oh, a lot of scrapping. Oh, United back on it once again, a lot of scrapping. Oh, Cavani, oh, Cavani again. Cavani shoots, and Cavani scores. So Cavani gets a goal, making it United 2, Roma 3. I don't know whether at this stage in the game we're going to be able to get that equalising third goal or not. Let's have another look at it. There was quite a bit of scrapping going on in the box in all fairness. And eventually the second shot away, Cavini manages to shoot it into the goal. Ah. 
And that is going to do it for the game. So it finishes Roma FC 3, Manchester United 2. So I think Jackson actually did pretty well for his debut. He had a few touches on the ball, which probably wasn't a bad shout for his first game. But let's have a quick look here. So we've got a manager rating of 6.3. Match rating, I'm sorry, of 6.3. Minutes played 10. Passes complete 4. He didn't make any tackles. The par passing accuracy was 100. So there we are then. 2-3 it is. We didn't manage to win that first goal, that first game of the season. I'm sorry, the first friendly of the season. We've dipped down a bit in manager rating, which I kind of expected anyway, because we didn't manage to live up to what they were expecting of us. And so now it's time to advance on and see where we are going next. It's going to be DC United versus Manchester United this time out. Okay, so we are 4-0 up against DC United here. We, I presume, are coming on to win the game now, actually securing it any more than we already could. We are once again going to play as a team. Probably going to play all of these games as a team, in all fairness. Just because it's the way I prefer to play. Okay, so 81 minutes played, 9 minutes left. We need a manager rating of 6.5, a match rating of 6.5, sorry. We need to score at least one goal and have a 30% dribble rate. Okay, so DC United have a corner to start off with, which they cross in. We clear that with no real problems. We take possession back of the ball. Jackson is on the ball now. It's his first touch of the game. Passes to Fernandez, to Dalio. Dalo, I'm sorry. To Fernandez once again, to Rashford. Oh, Rashford loses out. Manchester United's throwing. So it's Dalo to throw in. Goes to Fernandez. Fernandez manages to lose it. There's a bit of a scrap. I thought that might have been a foul, but maybe not. Sancho manages to keep hold of the ball. Back to Rashford. On to Jackson. Jackson's on and Jackson scores. Jackson's first goal playing for Manchester United. The first of his professional career. What a goal it was too. So we're going to have a look at that once again here. So there's a lot of passing going on in the game so far. It's been really good. And then Jackson just hammers that shot home. Fantastic. And we're on the ball once again. Can we do something with it? Sancho down to Jackson. Across trying to find somebody but lost it. Rashford on the ball currently. Rashford not letting up. Going to Fernandez. Going across to Jackson. Goal number two. And also a really good goal once again. Good play from Manchester United this far. Okay, let's have another look at that here once again. There was a bit of moving around from Rashford. Two passes across to Jackson and in. We've got the ball back. Jackson's on that ball once again. Passes to Rashford here. Can we do anything else with it now? Rashford still has it to Fernandez. Loses the ball. Sancho on the ball. Jackson. Oh, Jackson tries to pass through to Fernandez but doesn't get the chance. Rashford on the ball now. To Sancho. To Fred. To Jackson. Oh, Jackson tries another shot but doesn't get in. And then loses the ball subsequently. And that is game, set and match. It's DC United 0 and Manchester United 6. We managed to come on, score two goals with Jackson. I think the manager will be pretty happy with that performance from Jackson and the whole team overall. So here we go then. we got a match rating of 8.8, .8, minutes played 10, goals 2. Assists, none. Shots on target, two. Conversion rate, 66%. And we are now going to advance on, and we're going to find out who we are playing next. So it's Man United versus Piamonte. I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong. We are still a substitute. So it's the 79th minute this time. We are 1-0 up against these guys, and we are going to come on and control the team, and hopefully far home another goal off to and secure the win okay so our match objectives get a match rating of 6.5 get one goal or assist and score at least one goal from outside the box
Ah, uh, counter time once again. Through to Jackson here. And Jackson scores a goal. Fantastic. Goal number three of his career. So let's have a look at the replay here once again. It was passed through a couple of times. Through to Jackson in space. Round the keeper. Boom. So Greenwood to McTominay to Fred. Through to Jackson, but it was offside. So if he'd gone through, he wouldn't have got the goal anyway. And now we can clearly see that, unfortunately, the time it was played through, he would have been offside. And we've entered the final five minutes. Intercepted once again here, Pogba to Fred, to through to Jackson, what can we do with it now? And a goal, that was a sensational goal. It's a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Oh, being surrounded and they lost possession quite easily there. So Greenwood currently on the ball, through to Jackson here. Jackson manages to lose the ball. And then we get it back. Pogba to Jackson once again. Back to Fred. Oh, Fred nearly tripped, but he manages to contain his composure. Shaw's got it to Fred. To Greenwood. And Greenwood gets the goal. Fantastic shot once again. And that celebration is something else. So let's have another look at that then. So we're going to go in, passing, lots of passing going on, around the keeper and in. A lot of teamwork, fantastic. So Pogba's on the ball currently, through to Fred, across to Greenwood, but that is game, set and match. Man United 4, Piemonte 0. So we got a match rating on 9.7, 12 minutes played, 2 goals, no assists, 4 shots on target and a 33% conversion rate. The manager can't be much happier with us than that. So there we go, our player rating jumped up quite considerably that time and quite rightly so because we've put in quite the performance once again. So time to now advance on and see where we are in the next game. It's Man United versus Soledad. So it's the 61st minute this time, we are 1-0 up against Soledad. We are going to come on and play as a team and we're going to try and get a few more goals and secure the win once again. Okay, so we need a match rating of 6.5, complete three passes in the opponent's half and have a dribble success rate of 30%. We're hounding them, we're hounding them for the ball, we're going to get the ball, there we go, we've got it. Pogba to Fred, through to Jackson, on to Martel. Martel struggling but has the ball still, off to Pogba, off to Jackson, Jackson's shot, saved by the keeper. Okay, so Bruno Fernandes to take the corner, crosses it in here. We don't get ahead to it, they do, they clear it. They're taking their time to get rid of the ball and they've lost it back to us. Martel has the ball and lost it as well. We are hounding them for it though, they're not doing particularly well in space. We're hounding them for the ball. Fred now has the ball off of an interception through to Martel. Through to Pogba. Pogba nearly loses the ball, but he's back on it. Tries to cross it into Jackson, but fails. And we're handling them once again, and we've won it. Fred got the ball. Through to McTonome. On to Jackson. Jackson hits the ball and scores a goal. Fantastic. Gets another goal here. I believe it's his fifth of his career. He's on a winning streak already. And it's only match three. Let's have another look at that here then. So there's quite a bit of passing through once again. A lot of shaky screens as well. And then Jackson gets the ball and in it goes. They have a goal kick. Out to the centre of the pitch. We are already on the ball here. Through to Shaw. Off to Pogba. Pogba still has the ball. Yeah, back to Shaw. Through to Martel. Martel has an attempt on target and it goes straight into the top corner. Fantastic goal. So let's have a look at the replay once again here. 
Again, a lot of passing going on, through to the goal scorer, and in it goes. They go crossing in once again, that was too easy for us to defend. A quick spinny round through to Greenwood there. Bissaka on the ball, through to Jackson, back to Bissaka, Bissaka's shot, but it goes wide. So, they've got a free kick now then here. Down their end of the pitch. Man United have the first touch. McTominay through to Jackson. Let's see what can be done with this now. Jackson initially loses it, then Rashford manages to pick it up. He then passes to Martel. Through to Jackson, and an attempt on target is once again blocked by the keeper. We don't have long left in this match, but we're going to play out the corner nonetheless. Rashford. Oh, so Rashford crossed in, nothing unfortunately came of it, and that is going to be full time. Man United 3, Real Solidad 0. So here we go then, the match rating was 8.8, .8. minutes played 31, goals 1, assists none, shots on target 5, conversion rate 14%. So there we have it, a 3-0 win and that has booked our place in the final. We're going to advance on now, we know it's the final, we know we're going up against Roma FC. And it also looks like I have to sim the match as well, so they won't let me play the final. Obviously I'm not ready, I'm only on the bench. I've not actually started for United yet, but we'll sim the game anyway, and we'll see how we get on here. And it was 2-2, two, two, and we lost out on penalties in the end. Okay, never, you know what, never mind. That's not, that's not the end of the world. Okay, and it would appear that our first game of the season is going to be Manchester United versus Leeds. That's going to be where we're going to leave this episode. I do hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, then please do be sure to hit the like button. I can't wait to play out the next episode and the episodes that will follow. If you are new to my channel, then please do hit subscribe. I'm going to be releasing these videos once a week, so you've always got something to look forward to. And also G Fuel videos every other week as well on the other day of the week that I upload. But for now, my name is Andrew. Thank you guys so very much for watching this very first episode. And I will catch you next week with the next one. Bye bye